name is Chanson Buchanan. I will be interviewing a few people and ask them five different questions on how Amazon has triumphed throughout the COVID-19 pandemic. I have worked at Amazon for a year as an e-commerce associate and I am eager to hear what people have to say about Amazon overall. Hi, my name is Kaya. Hi, Kaya. I have five questions for you. As I interviewed Kaya, a sophomore at Valdosta State University, we discussed why she chose Amazon as a consumer during the COVID-19 pandemic. Um, when you actually think about it, like Amazon has been ahead of the game, so they really don't have that many competitors so far as like, you know, online shopping for like everything. You can get groceries on Amazon, clothes, technology. It's like the Walmart of online shopping. Right. You can't get that anywhere else. As I interviewed Bobby, an Amazon employee that I've worked with, I asked a very critical question. I asked, do you enjoy working at Amazon? He had asked not to have his face shown nor his voice heard. But I did manage to take a couple of notes of how he interpreted Amazon in his own point of view as a worker. He states that the facility at Amazon has made a lot of effective changes to make the environment much more COVID-19 free. And he also enjoys the high tech at Amazon as well. Later that evening, I interviewed Steve, an Amazon employee that I have worked with in the past before as well. I asked Steve, what did Amazon provide for his personal needs during the pandemic of COVID-19? And he stated, one of the things I like what Amazon does, they issue us masks while we're working. They take the pandemic very serious. They followed all the CC guidelines to ensure that everyone at the workplace is safe. A New York Times article named, It's Now Amazon's Turn in the Spotlight, simply supported what Steve had said. In the article, it states, Other kinds of workers, doctors, and some health aides, cleaners, grocery workers, postal employees also have said their employers weren't doing enough to protect them as they interact with others in a pandemic. Maybe Amazon is doing a better job than others. Maybe not. The reality is there is rightfully significant attention on Amazon because it's a powerful company reshaping how the world shops and how industries operate. It also states that there are more than 50 Amazon facilities out of the more than 500 it operates in the United States, which at least one worker has tested positive for the coronavirus. Incredible. Steve concurred with Bobby that he enjoyed working at Amazon as well. Steve states in conclusion. One of the best things about Amazon is their flexible hours they offer us and a decent pay, as well as the benefits they offer us. In conclusion, Mr. Beso said, we expect to spend the entirety of that $4 billion and perhaps a bit more on COVID-related expenses, getting products to customers and keeping employees safe. Before I ended my interview with Kaya, we discussed how the warning signs appeared to her on how much higher costs are ahead for Amazon as a business and how it would affect customers. Are products on Amazon too high or are they just at the right prices? Depending on the vendor, I would say, because they will have um, literally like five products from like different prices. Right. So I feel like if you do your research, you can find something that's affordable, but they're going to throw out there the most expensive ones just so they get their money. Okay. Finally, I asked Kaya, would she ever recommend any other people or herself to work at Amazon? Um, yeah, totally. Um, I know Amazon Warehouse is hiring for like... I think it was like $16 an hour. Mm -hmm. I know some in Atlanta that are like 20 bucks an hour. So they definitely are very, very considerate with their hourly wages and stuff like that. So I would definitely recommend it for people. Mm -hmm. And this concludes my Amazon documentary. Thanks for watching.